Hello. Hi. Uh, introduce yourself. What is your name today? Today. Today. Yes. <laughs> My name We is... We play. My name is Natalia Peruz, also known as the Saw Lady. The the Song Lady. The Saw. The Saw Lady. The Saw. Yeah. And uh, uh, why did you decide to uh, play with this weapon? <laughs> um. What uh, was your? Uh, I was inspired. Idea? I was inspired by both the sound, which is very unique and kind of spiritual and the visual because this is one of the only musical instruments where when you play it the entire instrument moves if you think of a violin the bow moves but the violin doesn't move right do you but believe here, uh, you can move people with this i hope so i try <laughs> and the and way the why do you want to uh, move people for well what? um when you look at people on the street, you see how they're stressed out and they're worried. Is that a and good thing? That's not a good thing. So with my music, I try to relax But this relax is New York. Them. Everyone is normally stressed out. That's true. That is why I think the the job of the street performer is to give people a moment of rest, to give them some music, something beautiful that they can concentrate on, and for a moment forget their problems, and you know just recharge their batteries, and then go on and continue with re renewed energy to deal with their problems. Uh, how long have you been moving people? <laughs> I've been uh, playing for about 14 years. Uh, with this weapon <laughs> and uh, tell me about the teeth uh, what happened to the teeth well um, a few years ago I was playing at Times Square and an undercover police lady gave me a ticket for a hundred and fifty dollars and she, she told me that it's because the teeth of the saw that's a weapon and I cannot have it in a public space so if I wanted to continue to perform in a public space, I had to get rid of the teeth. Did she see any evidence of you cutting someone's <laughs> head or whatever? No, no, of course not. And I, I even said to her, look, I'm sitting down and the teeth face me. So if ever, anything should happen, I would be the one to right. get hurt. It would be like a suicide and attack or something <laughs> like, am I correct? But I've, I've been playing for so many years and I was never cut by the teeth. But anyway, she said to me, no, you never know when a crazy person Person might come, snatch the soul oh, away from I'm, you. I heard, yes, that's start. true. In America, a lot of crazy people. But I'm telling you, I've been playing for 14 years and never had anybody tried to snatch the soul away from me. And I met a lot of crazy people, but they all turned out to be very nice. Okay, and uh, you, you, uh, you took out the teeth. How you took out the teeth? I had Did you go to the dentist or something like that? <laughs> was this uh, some kind of uh, operation? Uh, well, it was an operation, but um, I had a friend of mine do it for me. Um, he's very good with his hands is and he, he has a tools. Is he person too? Yes, he is. He uh, playing is. the same weapon? Yes, he does. Uh, well, he did. Unfortunately, he passed away. But he oh, did. So one of the times uh, no, the no. teeth had some uh, <laughs> problems. No, no, no. He wasn't How killed he... by the the saw. Why? Why is he gone? What? what Just happened? old age. Oh, he was an old man. Yeah. Uh, let him rest in peace. Uh, tell me, what would you like to tell to all the creatures watching it right now? <laughs> Uh, well, enjoy the beautiful music and come visit me at my website, sawlady.com. Which is right here. Am I correct? That's right. And on my hat, right here. And on your hat, too. All right. And... Uh... <laughs> hey!